Alright guys, how's it going? So, we are going to be looking at the LAPA Lapa submachine gun, the newest gun that we got up here in Season 6. Let me get my thing back on my screen. And we got it DM Ultra as we do spend a lot of time loving and rubbing on this here new submachine gun. And I gotta say, I really do enjoy it. Uh, there's a couple gripes I got. We'll touch on that once we get in the game. Uh, you know... <clears throat> I feel like it's a really solid balanced sub compared to some of the other ones that we got. But just getting right into the class setups themselves starting off, we have our perk greed setup, which is really my go-to. I feel like it's just the best combination, and it's one that you could also use in Warzone. But looking at the attachments that we got on the muzzle, we got the infantry compensator for the recoil control. This thing already has very good recoil control, and if you wanted to go suppressor, feel free to do so. Uh, I just like keeping the firepower where it is as much as possible. Uh, then going down on the body, we got that SWAT 5 milliwatt laser. That right there, if you're working on getting DM Ultra or any of the camos, if you're going into hardcore, you definitely want that SWAT 5 milliwatt laser. But it comes in very handy in core as well because this thing does have good hit fire accuracy. Underbarrel S5 speed grip, magazine 50 round mag. You could also go with the 45 round mag, but just something about adding that extra 5 bullets in core can be very helpful and then finally we got the airborne elastic wrap on the handle now on to the gunfighter class setup for the optic i like the micro you know led but feel free to choose any optic that you prefer if you're going for longer range stuff you know you could throw on something like the three times zoom or just something with a wee bit more magnification for the muzzle sound suppressor barrel the 7.9 br compact if ever the body sticking with the swat 5 milliwatt lasers we do s5 speed grip we got the 45 round fast mag on this one just to kind of help balance out the mobility going down airborne elastic wrap handle and then the raider stock so there we go that is the two class setups for this weapon that i have found that perform the best at least with my play style so without further ado let's take and hop into a match of the new nuketown hot week well it's not new it's been out for a, i don't know about a week now i guess but to celebrate the halloween season and uh you know shoot some jack-o-lanterns and we got nuketown hardpoint let's get it look at that nice metallic finish we got on this bad boy starting off with our perk greed setup now one thing whenever i first started using this weapon one thing that bugged me was the like the iron sights on this thing but you really do get used to how it feels and i'm i'm not just saying that like it took me a while not gonna lie but i mean after really god dang let's just get absolutely smoked out over here ain't gonna be no mosquitoes bugging us let's get the scream man over there the damage on this seems to be i don't know i mean for the compared to some of the other subs on here the damage is Where'd you go? Oh, okay, he's up top. The, do the damage? The damage is phenomenal. And, uh, there's... Oh, there's another attach... Oh, Jesus Christ. There's ammo attachment where it's like, uh... I, I should have actually touched on it whenever we was in the class menu. But it was talking about how it's got, like, some type of, imp like, improved primer that increases velocity or something. And I thought, you know what? That might be okay, but then, like, with the ammo capacity that you get and then the little bump in damage... It's really not worth it whatsoever. Ah, penis. Oh, yeah. You know what? Probably be a good idea to reload. Let's hop up here. We got anybody in the window? Nope. We'll use this for a little bit longer. We should be playing the objective. This is a really good class setup to play the objective with. Oh, no. Right in the back, me. Let's get one more uh, one more round in with this, and then we'll go into uh, looking at the gunfighter setup, and we'll just kind of swap back and forth between it. But I really do. Uh, this, this setup right here, I mean... I was about to say, look at, <clears throat> screw these allergies, brothers, Jesus Christ. I was about to say how you can uh, really reach out and touch somebody with uh, with this setup, and you, you can. I mean, you can compete with a lot of ARs. Uh, what, it's just, you know, with the head camps and stuff, you got to be mindful of, uh, you know, what's to the left and right of you because, okay, I disagree with that one. Okay, let's switch to the gunfighter setup. So the ADS time is about the same. You notice... Oh, you notice like a slight difference, um, and I almost feel like the damage is slightly reduced with this setup. I could be wrong. It could just be like the feeling of having that suppressor on there. Uh, oh my god, bro. This game's going to be over fast. We are absolutely bending these guys over. I don't even think I need to play the hard point. Okay, let's bounce that off that car. Boom. Get the screen man. 
Where you at, bro? Oh, okay, let's pop it down. So the 45 round mag, it, like I said, it's more than enough. So you could always take and throw that one on the... Oh, hello. Is that an enemy thing? No, okay. You could always take and throw that on the uh, the perk greed setup and be just fine and dandy. But I don't know. I just I, I feel like that, that one with the 50 round mags more than perfect all in a, its own and how it's already set up. And you know, I feel like this setup should be okay. Yeah, I'm going back this one right here. This one, this one right here is just my favorite. Me and this one clicks. This is the one that I would say hands down is your best option, the best setup. It just, I don't know, it just flows really well, and it's the one that I've had the most, uh, the best games with, the best performance. It just seems to shut people down super quick. We're okay. I'm, I'm oh, t oh, hello. What's happening? Where do who just got shot from where? Come here. There we go. I have to get some 12 gauge action up in here. And there's the knife man trying to play out the Halloween fantasies that he can't live out in real life. Let's pop it down over there. You know, I don't I don't even really like the uh the scream skin person. Hello? Oh my wiener. Get out of here, son. Break your nose through your mask. Look at that. Reload that. Pop that in. Bop. So, I mean, sure, that slower reload time could maybe get you in a pickle or two at times, but I haven't I haven't really found that to be much of an issue, in all honesty. Oh, god dang it, of course there had to be some pussy on the stairs. But you know you're doing good in hard point whenever you can take and have only 10 seconds in the hard point and be at the top of the leaderboard. It's because we're dropping them bodies like nobody's business. And it seems like, I think my teammates are like, well, maybe not, because we're still kind of racking it up. I was about to say, though, it seems like my teammates are purposely backing off trying to get the hard point just so we can extend the game's life a wee bit. Grenade, do your duties. God dang, why is everybody smoking it out? There must be 20 people using thermals right now. I guess that would throw a monkey wrench into anybody that's trying to use the, uh, oh, nope. God, I, I should have whipped out the good old uh, double B arrow shotgun. <clears throat> With the dragon's breath on it. That's the other thing. You gotta watch out them Halloween costumes. You know how flammable they get. I knew I was gonna lose that when I shot too far to the left. Getting a wee bit cocky with it. My right thumb's starting to check me. You know, you gotta watch the arrogance here. You can't be, you can't be, uh, you know, too good. You don't wanna get reported for, uh, whipping out. Oh, whipping out the hacks. Oh my god. I feel, oh my, wait. I was about to say, I'm glad that he killed me because I'd have felt bad if, if I killed him. Because he had a kniff and I run right into him and gave him a French kiss with my tongue. <clears throat> but yeah, speaking of hackers, it's a different game. I was on Modern Warfare, like, right, they had, like, a 1v1 thing. Uh, they, it, it's not playable right now. Uh, they, they changed it to, to something else. I think, like, the 3v3 snipers or something. But I got into a lobby there with a hacker that was, like, he was using the scar and every, every time it was just, like, a headshot instantly. Like, I'd, I'd run into that before on, in Warzone, but I'd never run into somebody that was, like, found out a way to use that in uh, in Modern Warfare, like in the other playlist, but oh, okay, on fire. Not in the good one. Okay, now we should probably be a little worried. Can't see nothing. Jesus Christ. Uh, God, it's that same ghost pussy with the green bullets. Okay, yeah, let's, let's, let's start helping the homies out. We can throw the KD to the wind. We've got enough of a cushion. Where are we at? Bop, bop, bop. The fact that he didn't see me kind of makes me feel... No, God, the pullout... Pullout time. The pullout time with the good old double barrel... Sh with the uh, <clears throat> marshal is just not that peachy. Contested. Tagged him. Bagged him. Oh. Your mother doesn't love you if you're on the other team. Just remember that. Where you at? Come on. Peek it. Peek it. I'm kind of just hoping my teammates will continue to grind up in on that hard point like they was at the beginning. Okay, let's just do this. Okay, is everybody going to the garage? Okay, or is everybody upstairs? Gee, what is happening? How did it... Dude, I have never understood that about Nuketown. What is... Okay, I guess if it kind of falls in the front... Okay, I am getting tired of that man with his green gun. What gun is that? Is that the Galil? I, I didn't see the uh, I didn't see the menu thing quite quick enough. There we go. Tag him up. Okay, and I think they're going to have spawns, so we need to flip that ASAP. 
Okay, let's not get shot in the back if we can help it. Okay, yeah, boom. And I think we got spawns now. Let's see what we got. 183, 107. Yeah, we got this right in the handbag, brother. Louis Vuitton and Chanel about to have a baby in this handbag that we about to have this in. Come through the front door. Ouch. Come on. Can't see nothing. Okay, yep, let's back it out. Throw that there. Yes, thank you, teammates. Somebody using a trophy system. I never have teammates that use trophy systems. And by God, I know that I don't want to use them. Oh, where you at? Dude, I mean, what could the timing be any worse in that situation? I mean, really. Now, we got other people pulling out the LAPA. Oh, teammate, you about got got. Dude, I went from just clapping cheeks to getting a flipping colonoscopy all at the same game. Come here. That's that green pussy. You're mine, baby. Oh, there's two of them. I bet they both have the green bullets. Bunch of Halloween whores. Okay, where are we at? Teammates, stay on that bad boy. We're going to lock down this left side right here. Ain't going to know what hit them. You get that knife out of here. Is everybody on that team using that skin, or is like they're just like the two people constantly switching to different weapons? Because I've only, I feel like I've only seen like one other skin being used on the enemy team. Okay, boom. Let's get in on the last few seconds here, and there we go, victory, thirty-nine seventeen. We ended up pulling in. You know, normally we're like in the two-minute range with the hard point game, but you know it is. How did we not get final? Okay, this guy just must have like unloaded a whole belt on the enemy team and killed everybody well actually the, and the, it's probably because he was on the hard point too that helps but anyways guys there you go that is the lap of submachine gun it is a very nice highly recommend using it very fun to use and uh i've not played around with it much in warzone to be honest because i don't really i don't feel like using subs in warzone is a great idea um compared i mean because you know ar's you're, you're dealing with ARs, TAC rifles, LMGs, and mostly longer range engagements. So, you know, if you find one, pick it up. It would be a good secondary for close range. But, like, as far as, like, a loadout drop and getting it, wouldn't recommend it. But that's all for this one, ladies and gentle titties. Uh, I'm looking forward to showing you guys my Halloween costume. Turned out very good, the Peaky Blinder setup. Um, and, yeah, so... Hit that thumbs up button, guys. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit Check the links in the description of my other channel. Sub to those as well. Hit me up in the comment section. And until the next one, adios.